Hello, welcome to all. Today, our discussion topic for this tutorial is how can we reverse the project stock and resolve the project stock still exist error while closing the WBS. Okay. So let's start the topic. First, we are going to open the WBS. Okay. Suppose uh, we have a project in which there are so many WBS element. So we are going to open in CZ02 and trying to close the WBS. Okay. So you need to fill the project definition in the project definition column and click on the enter. Go in the back, click on the project definition. Okay. And see this project in, in CRTD state at initial state. So go in the edit and go in the status, go in TECO. Click on the close B and save. So whole project is now cancelled. Okay. See the status. CLST. <coughs> Although this project is in PECT stage. So no work has been done. So we have directly closed this WB project. Okay. Now the second one is we have a, a project in which there are so many 10 to 10 WBS element. Okay. No, 13 WBS element. So once we are trying to close whole WBS, <coughs> go in the edit, go in the status, go in the technically complete. You need to click on the technically complete. Okay. See, this is the main issue of this WBS. <coughs> Stock still exist. Stock still exist. See in this WBS. Which WBS? FA oblique 18 oblique 0. 18848.0. So, what is the meaning of stall st stock exist sticks? Okay. Once we create the WBS, done the material planning or uh, material any material planning, then we have to do two steps. First, we need to create the project stock using transfer posting in the WBS using 415 movement type. Okay. Then once we complete the 415 movement type, then we need to good issue against reservation, good issue against reservation. That is, uh, good issue against reservation means good issue from storage location to your WBS network element. So, at that time, 281 movement type will be used. So, our project stock has been successfully issued in these two phase manner. But if we are not a we have not yet issue project stock using 281 moment type that still project stock exists or if there is a no need of that project stuff then we need to cancel the project stock so your commitment of the stock still exists in this wbs element is not reflecting and you will not get error while closing the wbs hope you understand So, go in the MBBS. In the MBBS, you need to fill the WBS element or project definition. So, we, we are filling the WBS project definition instead of the WBS. See, 27 quantity of one material, it still exists. So, we need to cancel these quantities 27 quantities of project stock either we have to issue okay see uh, in mb51 uh, fill the plant code you can fill the 
moment type 415 also see the first uh, entry is of the 415 moment type where thousand storage location is existing here okay there is no 281 moment type is there so we that's why this is reflecting the issue okay okay so we need to cancel this project start by using cancel the material document okay so here we are cancelling this material document and you need to fill the proper reason as the planning KRL SSA reversal okay click on the print active click on the check if no issue is there then click on the post okay hope you understand then we have successfully reversed the project star now we are trying to close the project so go in the status click on the technically complete <coughs> go again in the status click on the close b okay so and click on the posting okay <coughs> once we click on this uh, save oh successfully close the wbs all the wbs all the 13 l wbs element are successfully closed okay so this is the beauty of sap process you need to not you need not to close each and every wbs in each and every time first you need to complete all the activities which is planned in this project like uh, still till the issue the project start complete all the purchase orders which are created for the services and uh, capitalize each and every no pending stock no pending amount no unsettled cost okay uh, and once the complete capitalization is done complete borrowing cost has been posted then you need to then you need to close such wbs take the certificate from the uh, concerned project in charge and close the WBS because once you close the WBS then unnecessary pending project where is not reflecting once you close the WBS then you trying to settle the CWIP okay CWIP is very important see once the we settle the CWIP and is capitalized in the asset then it's uh, reflect our books value and increase our books with the certain asset amounts okay so our main objective is to close the wbs once it finished as soon as possible and take the uh, certificate from the concerned project in charge this project has been completed now and such and such date start from this date start from the such date okay and also you reconcile the project stock which are uh, by mistakenly bind in the project and if there is a no current use of those project stock you can reverse the project stock and that project stock will unrestrictly use in our available in our warehouse and storage location we will use at some different location okay hope you understand thanks for watching this sap tutorial please share this knowledge with your colleagues and friends they will also get benefited and understand what is the exactly process is going in SAP PS. Okay. Have a nice day. See you. Bye bye.